Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to the channel. It's the girl Cindy here back with another video and in today's video we are doing a closet organization. I did do some minor upgrades to our bedroom but the closet girl, the closet was given very much disorganized, very much I don't like to clean and if you know me or if you watch my channel often then you know that is not the case at all. Uh, I knew I was gonna do this project like it was upcoming so I kind of just let the closet go to what you are seeing right here absolute mess okay we get certain clothes dry clean and then I wash some of our clothes so the dry clean clothes would come back on wire hangers so we have like a mix of wire hangers and black plastic hangers in this closet we don't really have a place for our shoes we have all these boxes up here some are empty some having shoes so yeah we just really need to get this closet all the way together so that's what we gonna do in this video let's jump right in last, last, last. So I started off by removing all my clothes from the closet and the reason being is I wanted to get rid of all the wire hangers and I also wanted to color coordinate my clothes as much as I possibly could. As for our shoes, I removed all these out the closet as well. I finally got a shoe organizer or like a hanging behind the door shoe rack which you guys will see in a little bit. After I was done removing all the shoes from the closet, I went ahead and vacuumed the entire closet ensuring that I got every corner of the closet closet because it's been a hot minute i usually vacuum the areas that are clear in the closet but it's been a hot little minute since i vacuumed like all corners of our closet so i really wanted to ensure that i got the closet nice and clean before i put back our clothes and before i started really organizing stuff here i'm just showing you guys my mini michael kors bag collection i have a small one a medium sized one and a larger one that i use when i travel because it is the perfect size for my laptop i'm a huge michael kors fan i feel like you really get value for money with their bags and with all their products because i've had a michael kors watch and that too last me for a very long time but yes i've had each of these bags i think the smallest one is the newest and i've had that for about it's going on four years now so i've had the bigger one for almost six seven years and yeah they still look really really good Say she had bad. Anytime I knock, I knock with that. No rubber band, no rubber band. Every time I put down, they show me that. If I know pull out, she got my back. I do you go, I'm happy that. I do you go. Say everything I do is for my woman. Anything I talk, when you talk, I go do man. Here I am organizing my husband's dress shirts, hoodies, and sweatpants. I also got everything that was on a wire hanger on to a plastic hanger and I did my best to color coordinate his stuff just as I did with mine. This is the shoe organizer that I mentioned earlier. I purchased it from Target for under $30. And when I tell you I got over 20 pairs of shoes in this thing, it could hold up to 28 pairs. But I did put just one single shoe in certain slots. Shoes that were nicer or that I didn't want to really squeeze into one slot. I gave them their own slot. But still, 20 pairs of shoes and this thing was super easy to set up and put together i know i'm looking hella confused here because i didn't want to read listen the black girl in me did not want to read the instructions i just wanted to figure it out on my own so that's what i did but your girl did it okay and i got this thing up in under 10 minutes 
I'm so happy like I'm this is my favorite thing about the closet right now because the shoes are just out the way out of sight nicely organized Time to put my clothes back into the closet. I tried my best to show you as much clothes as I possibly could. Obviously, I didn't show you all because I do have some upcoming videos and I don't want to show you guys the clothes today that I'll be showing you in the upcoming video. But yeah, also, if I had shown you every single item, we would have been here way longer. I started this project at like 2 p.m. and at this point, it was 7 p.m. This video actually carried on into the next day because yeah, yeah, your girl was tired after this step okay but we're just going to montage this out so enjoy It is the next day and I am using command hooks. These are the two pound command hooks to hang my handbags. We live in an apartment and we're not trying to pay an arm and a leg when it's time to move out because we've damaged the heck out of these walls. But I also want to decorate. So these command hooks are my go-to when it comes to hanging absolutely anything. They have not failed me yet. These are the clear or see-through ones. Like I said, I love these things okay I use three command hooks to hang my three bags and then the other smaller bags I put on this top shelf which you will see in just a moment That is pretty much it for this closet organization, closet makeover, whatever you want to call it. I want to say thank you all so much for watching yet another video. I have a Zara haul coming up for you guys. You're not going to want to miss it, so be sure to stay tuned for that. If you're not subscribed, click that subscribe button. Give this video a great big thumbs up. It's free. It'll help your girl. Can't wait to see you in my next one. Bye, friends.